Hello Christ, today in my speech I will be telling you all how I've been using the peer evaluations from my value speech to help me with further speeches that are bound to come. First I would like to say, the peer evaluations that I looked on the most and that I saw the most from my fellow peers were that my rotating chair was kind of you know, like swerving or whatever, so I was moving a lot, so I'll stop on that. Uh, another comment that I saw was that I need to use more hand motions, hand gestures, facial expressions, those sort of things. Make better eye contact. Um, instead of looking above the camera, they're directly at it. So I want to go and elaborate on those comments. First, I know I should get a better chair. So this one swerves a lot, it rotates. So I'll do better on that one. I'll use more of my hands. I use my hands already, but I use them down here where you can't really see it, I need to be more up here, more facial gestures and all that with facial expressions. Uh, instead of looking above the camera directly at it, and the only reason I don't look directly at the camera is because my um, desktop has a built-in webcam, so it makes it look that way. I'm really looking at the camera, but it's just up there, so that's what I'm really looking at. And better lighting. And I have good lighting, it's just that the, um, it's just that it's not really hidden because of the webcam quality it messes it up for some reason. I don't know why it does that. But those are things that I'm definitely going to improve in my future speeches and more to come. I just want to make sure that I'm the best speaker that I can be. And I want to make sure that my rotating chair doesn't swerve anymore. I use more hand motions, make better eye contact. And instead of looking at the camera, I would look towards where the audience would be, which would be directly at the screen and get better lighting as well. Same, here's my card.